Eyewitness, witnesses are recounting the horrific moment 950 tons of concrete and steel came crashing down on a busy Florida road. A newly constructed pedestrian bridge collapsed this afternoon near Miami. Rescue workers say four people died and at least nine others were injured. Jeff Wagner reports that the bridge was built to be a safe crossing for students at the nearby university. Quickly and carefully, first responders searched for survivors beneath nearly two million pounds of rubble after a pedestrian bridge collapsed onto drivers along a Florida road. Cars were nearly flattened. Four people died. I jumped out of my car, locked my car, and I ran towards the victims to see if we could help anybody. But when I saw, the only thing you could see were, were the car lights in the front. It's totally smashed, almost to the ground. Nine victims were rushed to the hospital, some in critical condition, as search dogs helped crews find more possible victims. No pedestrians were walking on the bridge when it fell. This has been an incredibly tragic event, and uh, our hearts go out to the, the families uh, of, of the victims and everybody that was involved, and uh, rest assured that the fire department is going to be here through the end. Last weekend, the 174-foot-long bridge was put into place designed to connect the city of Sweetwater with the Florida International University campus. It spanned six lanes of traffic. Mania Construction Management built the bridge and released a statement in part extending its thoughts and prayers to the families involved. The bridge was reportedly designed to withstand a Category 5 hurricane. But I know we're going to all want to do our best to try to find out exactly what happened here and we will do that in a transparent manner. And again, if anybody's done anything wrong, we'll hold them, hold them accountable. Jeff Wagner, WCCO 4 News. And CBS News has learned that the two firms involved in the construction have been accused of unsafe practices in the past. One of those firms, Fig Bridge Group, designed and built the new I-35W bridge after it collapsed in 2007.